This fall, Rochester Public Schools is asking voters to approve a new investment plan called Ignite Student Learning. This plan would bring in more money each year to help all students learn, grow, and do their best. The plan would focus on four main areas. Staff positions, academic programs, student services, and our hands-on career classes. You might be wondering why our school district needs more funding. The answer is simple. Even though the district has tried hard to manage rising costs over the last few years, our schools still need a lot of help to provide the important things we need. Without extra money, the district will have to close some schools to balance the budget. They will have to put more kids in each classroom, which will make it harder for everyone to learn. Plus, they will have to cut important things like counselors who help us when we need them and really fun classes like welding and cooking classes where we get to make stuff and learn about careers. This November, district voters like our parents, teachers, coaches, bus drivers, and neighbors will get the chance to vote on a ballot question. This question asks if the school district can increase the current operating levy to provide an extra $19.4 million each year to support student learning. An operating levy is when people in our community help add money to the school budget. This money comes from property taxes, which help pay for teacher supplies and services at our school. If the operating levy increase is approved, the district would be able to keep our class sizes the same, keep all schools open, have enough teachers and staff to make academic and career programs stronger, and provide better support services. Without it, we won't have enough money to meet the needs of all students. This is a really important decision for our community, and you get to have the final say. If you go to the website, rochesterschools.org slash referendum, you can learn more about the money challenges at our schools, the plan to help fix them, how it affects property owners, and how you can vote on or before election day. There are even resources in other languages to help. Thanks for checking this out. It is awesome that you're taking the time to learn how to help ignite student learning for students like me.